Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I know you guys have been missing these vlogs because I keep getting DMs and comments, so I thought I would treat you guys to another vlog. But the reason I haven't really been consistent with my vlogs is because I feel like my weekends are very repetitive. All I do is go out and get content and eat food. Um, and although I said that on one of my Q&As on Instagram, you guys still said that you want to see the vlogs and you don't care if they're repetitive, so I am... Um, providing you with another vlog here. Um, it's Saturday and I'm just about to film a video. This video will actually be out. Oh, actually, I don't know, you might. Hmm, this video might not be out before or after, I don't know. Anyway, I'm just filming another casual spring outfit lookbook video and I have all my outfits prepped and planned here. Um, and True is just setting up all the lighting bits. It's a really gloomy day today. We were actually gonna go out originally to go and get some Instagram content but because it's quite gloomy I thought I'd film instead because I use my softbox light so I don't really rely on the sunlight as much as I used to and then tomorrow it's supposed to be a bit more sunnier so we'll go and get content so um as I said it'll be a content filled weekend but you guys said you don't mind so I'm going to bring you along with me I have to show you these beautiful roses that I received from a brand called Flowered. Um, I actually did a collaboration with them on Instagram and they sent me these beautiful bunch of roses. <laughs> Look at these antibacterial wipes ruining the aesthetic. Um, they sent me these beautiful roses and they were so big. I'll insert a picture. Um, the roses are so big that we had to separate them in like loads of little vases because we don't have a vase that's big enough to fit the whole bunch. So I have one up here in my bedroom and I absolutely love it. I wish that they would last forever because they're so gorgeous and I'm gonna be sad throwing them away. <laughs> So we finished filming, it's about 3.30 and we are at our favourite place ever, the only place we ever come to, Canary Wolf. I need to try and get like a content picture in the Sky Gardens but it looks so packed, the car park looks really packed um, so it might be busy but we'll see, I need to take a picture and then get something to eat because we are starving, it's 3.30 and we haven't eaten since breakfast. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get something to eat and then bubble tea and then oh yeah it's my best friend's birthday today jasmine's birthday happy birthday baby girl um yeah it's my best friend's birthday she's been my best friend since secondary school like we've been best friends since like year seven year eight so yeah basically i need to wrap her present are you guys i'm gonna show you what her present is but by the time this goes up she would have already seen it because i'm gonna drop it off to her today obviously we're in lockdown so it's gonna be a social distanced thing i'm not gonna meet her i'm just gonna go give her gift to her to her home um but i need to wrap that up and i also want to get her a bunch of flowers so after we eat and do all of that um we're gonna go to the florist and get her a bunch of flowers hope hopefully there's a florist here somewhere i think they shut down there was one but it shut down anyway do you want to say hi true Hey. Why? Where's your re reusable mask? I don't know. Lost it somewhere. True did his hair. Look, he's not wearing a cap today, guys. He made an effort for the vlog. He said, "I mean, it's a bit overgrown, but <laughs> we'll do." Do you want to say anything to the viewers? You know, this is like the vlogs is your channel as well because oh, you yeah. have a fan base. I don't know. I'm hungry right now. I can't really think. Um. I'm tired, I'm hungry. I have my new baby with me. Guys, this bag. Sorry, True, I know you're hungry. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I had a dream about this bag and I was desperate to get it. And look, look, it's here. Um, yeah, it's such, look how beautiful. But when we made you caught a cue, just let me take it out on you till I got nothing left to prove but gratitude. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're so. back with the goods. We went for Leon today. Because Leon is healthy fast food, so you know. 
We're gonna ignore the Olin scene in the cross town for now. And we're gonna focus on the positives is that we went for a healthy alternative today for lunch. I'm baked starving. I know I'm so hungry. Baked fries. Gluten free baked fries. Oh that sounds very healthy. And get the dip. Mm-hmm. Num. Korean burger. We also got the um, sweet corn ribs. I've wanted to try these sweet corn ribs. Let focus. There we go. I've wanted to try these sweet corn ribs for so long, but every time I go to Dion, they're always sold out. So finally, they had them in stock. It's really saucy, so please be neat. Oh, I thought you were talking to the viewers. Like. No, I'm talking to you. Because I remember from the last, last vlog, I found that um, thingy you dropped. It's not nice. This is the Korean burger, kimchi burger. I love kimchi. Yeah, we both do. I've been on a Korean hype recently. Yeah, it's all the K dramas we've been watching. I'm gonna try a sweet corn rib. The first bite was just bread. Oh, and it's truffle sweet corn rib. What? But I don't know if you eat the whole. Th you can't eat the whole thing, can you? Like the stem. It's just like. It's nice, but I feel like it's just gentrified sweet corn corn on the cob. Oh. Telling me not to make a mess, see? I'm just showing the views. I don't know what the hype was about these. It's corn on the cob with sauce on it. I don't know what I was expecting, but I thought it was like you could eat the whole thing. Finally got to the chicken. We're like halfway through when I'm finally I'm not chicken. halfway. Guys, haven't been doing much on my YouTube channel recently because I've been busy helping New Way out. Got so much content to make. No. And obviously, so has his full time job, so it's hard to, for him to make his own videos on top of my videos that we have to do. Um, yeah. One day. I feel like the bun is quite dry. Normally, it's like softer. I'll go up to the saucy bit. Yeah, this was not satisfying. We just why? You just dropped something. Guys, this is evidence. He always tells me off and gives me a warning like, oh, make sure you don't make a mess. What did I drop? I don't know, but I saw someone drop. No, I don't. And you're out here always dropping stuff. We'll see in a video when I edit it. What did I drop? We'll see in a video when I edit it. Yeah, that didn't do it for me. I need something else. Well, it's a good which thing is, we have. Which is why we got... It's not like it's an ad. <laughs> Lead and gone. Oh, I need something else. Which is why introducing... No, it's not sponsored, guys. Sponsored by Crosstown Donut. Not really. That would be a dream. Crosstown, if you're watching, hit me up. <laughs> I'm keeping that in. No, you're not. Everyone in my comments like, new, yes, a lady, like, because we edit out things like ogre. this. Everyone burps. Um, from Olinstein. We've got the social slice. Wow, they're actually really big. We could have just got one. We'll have one tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, that looks incredible. It's a cinnamon, basic like cinnamon roll. It's what they're famous for. It's called the social slice. Diet Coke for health. No sugar, sugar free. Mm. This is Drew's first time having Olenstein because every time we walk past it, I always tell him about it. I'm like, oh my god, this is Olenstein. They're really famous for their like cinnamon rolls and stuff like that. And today, finally, he was like, oh, should we try it? And he loves mm. it. It's so nice, isn't it? You can buy a big, basically, you can buy it like a massive one. Once at work, someone brought a massive one in. Sugar free. <laughs> Don't like it. Like <laughs> basically, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, the reason, basically, we have to try and cut down on sugar because True's mum and his dad told us off for eating too much sugar. <laughs> All we can see in your vlogs is you eating so much sugar 
That's why I'm being very conscious of what we're consuming. Sorry, mum and dad. Basically, everyone's telling us too much sugar, which I know. Once in a weekend. Yeah, guys, by the way, true's mum and dad. This is our first sugar this whole week. We haven't had any sugar. We're already having this one piece. This is our first this is our first sugar today in the week. I think we should just have the other one. Mmm. We'll have the donut now. <laughs> hey guys, it's like four hours later, like when you last saw me. Um I came home and had a nap and then I had to Clear, actually that's a lie I didn't clear up the room true actually did it um from like the mess of filming because so my room is literally so messy after filming if you do YouTube and you're like a vlogger or not vlogger what am I even saying if you do YouTube and you film YouTube videos you'll know how much of a mess like doing a video does anyway so I had a nap while true um cleaned up the room and then normally I always clean up the room but like today I was like super tired so true kindly offered to do that um but basically as i said it's jasmine's birthday um and we went to the florist but there was a, such a long queue for the florist and i could see from like the car into the shop they didn't have many bouquets so i called my mum and she was out and i asked if she could buy like bunches of flowers like individual like stems and if she could put together a flower like a flower bunch for jasmine because my mum is really good at kind of floral stuff she's not like a professional florist but she has like she has she's really good at making them so that was my like last option um and she did a really good job see when i come go downstairs so we've got the bouquet and it actually has um white and purple flowers and purple is one of jasmine's favorite colors so that's perfect and then i don't i couldn't find a nice gift box for her present so i got her let me show you because i don't want to take it out of the dust bag and stuff yeah I don't want to, I don't, let me get all the good lighting. I don't want to take, um, because I've just packed the bag away. Basically, I got her a Jacquemus bag because we always used to twin. When we were in secondary school, we used to like, every, we used to buy matching things and people would call us twins. And we did this thing called the challenge. And we like, we, t we lied and told everyone we were twins, even though we're not we can't be twins oh insert a picture of her here we look nothing alike but we would go around telling everyone we're twins anyway um so i just thought i love this bag so much and i know she would love it too and it's such a nice like neutral bag and it sold out literally everywhere and i managed to get her one um so literally we're gonna be twinning i bought her this bag it's packed away though and because okay so this is where i was coming okay, i couldn't find a nice gift box so I have put it into this toilet brush holder box and I'm going to, I'm going to wrap it up and I'm going to say to her like, oh, it's like a co, uh, I thought it would just be like a funny gift. I'll give you a proper gift when like COVID's over because that's always a good excuse for everything. When COVID's over, I'll do this when COVID's over. Anyway, so short open it thinking, oh, this was my idea of a dumb joke, which isn't even funny. And then she'll see a Jacquemus bag in here. I hope she loves it. So these are the flowers that my mum made. How beautiful are they? I love them so much. I feel like this is much better than what I would have got at the shop anyway. So they're just sitting in some water for the moment. But I'm going to take it like this in the car. And then when I go to give it to her, I'll take it out of the water. Um, but yeah, like these are just so pretty. I love them so much. Now I want these, but I can't keep them. Hey guys, this is like a couple of days from when you last saw my vlog. But basically, I don't know what happened in between these days. I'm just picking the vlog up from here. It's Saturday and we just shot some content in my favourite location, Rome Bank. Um, you should be seeing that on my Instagram soon. We did a really cool like real thing. I don't know if it'll work out, we'll see. Um, and then now we're actually what are we doing we're gonna get some we ha we ordered these k dogs which we're really excited to eat it's like a corn dog with like beef sausage and mozzarella we'll show you that um so yeah we've done our content for the day it's a really nice sunny day although right now it looks a bit cloudy i've got my new chanel bag out with me and we just shot a look in this jacques muscat and now we're gonna go and get some food and just take you along with us on the day. True, do you have anything to say? Let me show you. Surprise. Just There's nothing to say. Yeah. You got nothing to say? <laughs> How do you think the content turned out today? Um. So I wear down the carpet, trying hard to forget. But the feeling keeps rising. I can't deal with. $6.99 
60 pounds. Okay guys, so we got this bouquet for my sister. These flowers are so beautiful. I forgot what they're called. They're very, very something. We give me the R. They're so gorgeous. Okay guys, we have the goods in this bag. So the um, place is called uh, K Dogs and Juicy and they basically sell these Korean corn dogs. Um, and I think it's one of the only places in London that do them. But it's not actually like a restaurant. I don't know what it is, but it's like a pickup service. We pick it up. Um, Being someone's house. Yeah, maybe someone's house. Um, but I like saw so many good reviews and had a look at their page and it looks so good. So we had to get it. And they do, they have beef hot dogs, turkey hot dogs or vegan, which is really good. So there's loads of options. Oh my God. Look at me, show the vlogger. I'm so excited. Guys, look at this. <gasps> this looks so good. Oh my God. So what's what? Um, so this one has fries on the outside and it has sriracha mayo, parmesan flakes, and it's got beef and mozzarella inside, beef mm -hmm. hot dog and mozzarella. And then this one has, I you basically use what they recommend, sugar, honey mustard and ketchup. And this is just the original like beef yeah. just beef so i got two different ones because obviously we share all the time so we kind of have a little bit of each but this looks so good i'm so excited okay wait let's let me take a picture of it for my instagram as well do you want to get started on the chip one because that looks like the <laughs> i'm so excited to eat this it looks so good oh my god the cheese look at the oh wait wait let this bit fall for the vlog oh I feel like this is illegal. Like it can't, how, look at this cheese pool. <gasps> is there any sausage in here? I don't think so. It's just like a the sausage in that bit, okay. Mm. Mm. So this is, doesn't have any cheese. This is just literally the sausage in the corn, like a corn dog. Which I never had before because most places is pork and obviously we don't eat pork so. Have a run to the sausage shop. Oh, sausage is nice. Oh, oh the cheese part's at the top and then. Oh. So I feel like you didn't get the cheese so look, we'll have this. Hey guys, it's actually Sunday today. Yeah, so it's the next day. Oh, copyright. Um, it's Sunday, it's my sister's birthday but we had to quickly come to Canary Wharf because I needed to get an Instagram picture for an ad that I'm doing um, and I had to take it today and then I also had to pick up some bits because we're having like a lockdown birthday dinner for my sister and True is the chef so True is going to be cooking up her meal obviously I will be helping um, and we had to just pick up some like microgreens I didn't even know what microgreens were um, we had to pick up microgreens and we're starving so also picked up some sushi so I thought now was a perfect time to pick up the camera because we all know you love a little car mukbang. I think so far it's been like food. Yeah, I think this Three vlog in a row. is very food heavy. But that's just our life, isn't it? Wait. This is sushi. We have a salmon, spicy salmon crunch. It's my fave. Actually, it's a little bit spicy for me, to be honest. Sorry, guys, you're not going to see much of this food eating vlog because we're in a bit of a tight schedule. Because actually, now we have to go pick up my little sisters from my dad's house. And then go back home prep so true is just quickly munching this down so you're gonna enjoy true eating sushi mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh okay so this is the table set up for now we're going for like a spring theme so we've gone with like pink and yellow flowers and obviously spring is all about flowers and then i just received these cupcakes so i made an order um i will link the instagram page below but these are unreal so they're from a lady um called essex boo cakes and these are actually cupcakes how incredible do they look we're gonna obviously set up a bit more but this is right now what it looks like and i'm thinking to have the plates and then add a cupcake on each plate and true is just here prepping the food at the top of the back i dropped the camera today again i'm really beaten i feel like i'm really being happy if you watch my amalfi vlog you remember i dropped the camera and broke it and tried to fix it Thank you. um I dropped it again today and I feel like there's like the shutter is a little bit coming through. Um, but anyway, I thought I'd update you. I feel like this entire vlog is a little bit 
all over the place but I feel like that's my life. Um, it's just really hard to pick up the camera when I'm like busy doing stuff and it's like today's been a really busy day having to pick up stuff, get content and like we're under a tight time schedule because my sister has been told to come back home for seven for dinner so True the Chef is just... What's True doing? Let's see. What is this? Um, it's like some crunchy saffron. Oh, see True is doing Michelin star for us so this is what he's... This is a crunchy saffron thing I assume for like decoration. It's so difficult to look, it's messing up so badly. But, we have but those look good, the ones you just did. Yeah, I'm saying this is trial and error. Ah. We have two hours left before. Two hours left. How are you feeling? Before everyone comes to the restaurant. How are you feeling about it? Look, he's got his whole Your chef. Chest. <laughs> chef outfit on today sunday so i have my sunday video scheduled to go up which will be up by now this is what the table is looking like currently um we're obviously gonna have to set the plates up and put a banner up on the wall the wall's looking very bare but i absolutely love these flowers i think it looks so pretty it's very spring vibes these little vases are from ikea and the candle like holder plate thing is also from ikea which is perfect because this is exactly what we were going for um, and the candle holders, I believe, are from H&M Home. So we are just setting up the table now. So we have these black slates and we're going to put a cupcake on each slate. And I think it just looks so pretty. It's going to look so nice when we have the candles lit. And yeah, we're almost done. So we've got different flowers on each one. Okay guys, so this is this is the setup with the candle lit now. I feel like the candles being lit just makes it look like a whole nother setup. It's so beautiful. I'm so happy with it. Good job, mum. Thank you. And True's just in the back, still chefing it up, working hard. He's gonna be applying for Master Chef next year. Oh, you look so pretty amongst the flowers, like it she just suits like you. Yeah, she's a flower herself. This is what it looks like inside the cake. Chocolate. Mm. And this is inside. Let me see what it would look like before. There. Oh wow, you've demolished it. That's my one. with oyster potato. This is like a saffron nest, truffle mayo and micro greens. Hey! Hey! I got my camera. So I got them these little cameras and they've been taking pictures all night. They're from Amazon and I've, I think they've been going viral online so I had to get them a camera each and this is the birthday girl waiting to be served her food. <laughs> this is the behind the scenes that goes into it. Wow, we're doing a different one each plate, yeah? Good. 
Mm -hmm. He's doing like different styles. Beautiful. How is it, Mum? Undescribable. Rate it out of 10. 15. Wow, 15, true. My best. Hey everyone, um, it's the next day. Yesterday was my sister's birthday um, and I feel like I just showed you like little snippets of the birthday vlog but I hope you enjoyed that. Today it is such a beautiful day outside. It's 22 degrees which is like summer in London. Um, so I have a dress on, I have my coach bag with me today. I'm gonna go to the park. I'm just so happy, like the weather puts me in such a good mood. So I thought I'd pick up the camera and continue the vlog for you guys. Oh yeah, okay, so this is my OOTD. Um, this black dress is from New Look. I'm not sure if there is, if there's in stock. If there's in stock, I'll link it down below. But I think it's such a good dupe for the sleeper dress. And I think this was only like £25 and it's so cute. And then I have my little green bag, a pop of colour. And this is my OOTD. And True is just at the front. He's about to wash his car because the sun is shining and he has lots of bird people in his car. So he's washing that. And yeah, we're going to go to the park and I'll bring you guys along with me. This is True trying to clean the bird poo off of his car. Making this a bird watch channel again. It doesn't do us good to memorize details of another time. Never to hide. Hey guys, we're in the car now. We actually went for a little walk in the park. We were at Victoria Park, which is a really beautiful park. And we just had a nice little walk past the canals and the sun is still shining. It's such a beautiful day. It's honestly like lifted the mood of everyone like everyone's just so happy and also today is the first day in the UK where groups of six can meet outdoors so like the park was packed with people who probably have not seen each other for ages because you're allowed to now which is so lovely and then soon the shops are gonna open and I just can't wait for summer like we're in spring now and the sun shining just makes me all make me go I can't even speak spring has sprung spring, spring. has sprung Brunk. yeah it's just such a beautiful day like it just puts me in the best mood ever i filmed a reel today as well because i can only film reels really when the sun is out because i need that natural light because ring lights and softbox lights don't work for me in reels i mean they work but i'm not happy with how they look so yeah i've filmed a reel today tomorrow we're gonna be filming again because it's a really nice sunny day i took my bag for her first out no second outing actually such a gorgeous green bag. I feel like this is perfect for the weather we're in now. Yeah, so we've come up from the park, so we're going to Tesco now to do a food shop because we have no food in the fridge. Yesterday was so stressful. Oh yeah, because Trudy didn't get to speak yesterday from um, cooking. So you obviously saw all the snippets and all like the lovely food that he made, which was actually like incredible. But do you yeah, want to talk? Normally I'm, I man the camera, but yesterday I couldn't because I was so under pressure <laughs> making all of those meals. Yeah, so guys, time. I had to basically vlog, which I'm not really great at because I was also doing so much and also I wanted to be in the moment. So it's hard to like vlog and also try and be in the moment. So I feel like yesterday's birthday vlog was a little bit jumpy, but I hope you enjoy it anyway. Do you want to say chef true, mastermind true? Mastermind. I mean master chef. <laughs> What's that show called master chef? How are you feeling today true? Better. <laughs> Wait, but you, it sounds like we forced you to do it. No, it was just to let you know, this was all True's choice to make it. I was the one who was actually going to make everything, but he was like, no, he took control of it. So, yeah, just so you guys know, before anyone comes on here, like, ow, I feel so sorry for True. Can you let them know? <laughs> I'm like, let them know now that I didn't take it. Let them know. Don't do it, don't do that. Um, yeah, so disclaimer that was all True's choice to make the food, guys. Don't worry. He's, we haven't locked him up and forced him to do that. I don't know if I mentioned in the vlog, I can't remember what I've said, um, but for starters we had beef and potatoes and then for the mains we had lamb chops with like a vegetable medley. Is that what it's called? Vegetable medley? I don't know. With a vegetable, like a mixed grilled vegetables and potatoes as well, but like a different version of potatoes. Um, and it was just so tasty. Oh, 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 oh. 
miss the exit. Okay, maybe we should stop vlogging. We're at Starbucks. Okay, so we're at Starbucks now before we do our Tesco shop and I want to get this tea, um, this drink that I saw on TikTok. It is a... TikTok literally just controls our life, basically. Everything that I want is from TikTok. Um, it's a peach green tea lemonade with strawberry sauce in the cup and it looks really good. This is the... Sounds really like American. Yeah, but this was a UK. I made sure to find a UK one because the US has like a lot more things than than what we have. Their Starbucks is so much better. We got the drink, guys. I've got the drink. It's a peach green tea lemonade with strawberry sauce. And let's do a taste test. I feel like I need to mix it a little bit to see if it tastes good. Mm. I like that. It's a very refreshing drink and it's like sweet. Yeah. It's nice, isn't it? Hey guys, quick update. Um, we did our food shop at Tesco and then we decided to go to McDonald's, so we had a McDonald's, but I didn't vlog because I just felt so guilty <laughs> um, for eating McDonald's, so I literally, we just ate that because we're so tired. True especially feels really tired because he woke up super early this morning um, and he couldn't be bothered to cook and he wanted to have a like specific meal. So we just like decided to have a McDonald's and now we've come home and are literally just gonna get ready for bed and probably watch the Sea Spiracy, I think that's what it's called, a documentary about the sea. Um, I've seen everyone talk about it on Instagram so I thought we would watch that. I love watching documentaries and apparently this one's an eye opener. So yeah, I'm just gonna take my makeup off, get ready for bed and then watch that documentary. So unfortunately there's no cooking in this vlog and I also think that I'm gonna end the vlog here. Not I think that I am. <laughs> I'm ending the vlog here because I feel like this is just going to drag on for a long time. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, apologies again if it was a little bit all over the place. I feel like it's a true representation of my life. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in the next one. Bye!